Well, hello there, and thanks for coming by and having tea with Linda. In case you didn't know, I'm Linda. Hi! Today, my friends, it is day number 10. Can you believe it's already day number 10 that we are only 15 days from Christmas? Oh my God. It goes by faster and faster every year. I swear it does. Anyway, let's see what our Clipper Advent calendar of sticks and twigs has in store for us today on this very merry day 10. All right, day 10. It is white tea and raspberry. Oh, we have another tea leaf. So this is two with tea leaves. Uh, okay, white tea and raspberry. Raspberry flavored organic white tea. Our ingredients are white tea, natural raspberry flavoring with other natural flavorings and raspberry pieces. Okay. I enjoy raspberry so let's see how this white tea infusion it smells like raspberry so that's a good start i prefer it to smell like tea but you know we take what we can get we have our freshly boiled water even though my water looks gross it's just because of all of the hard metals and lead and you know, not fluoride that is in our well water. Um, all right, we will put this here and say, hey Siri, set a timer for three and a half minutes. All right, three minutes is our green one. If this is your first time at the channel, thank you very much for coming by. I appreciate it greatly. Welcome to our Advent series. Uh, this is the time of year when we gather our Advent calendars and try some new teas, uh, try some new brews, some new blends, um, and see what strikes our fancy. Hey Siri, stop timer. Okay, so our three and a half minute timer has elapsed. We will take our bag, dunk it a couple of times just for giggles and kicks, and we will remind ourselves what we are drinking today, which is white tea and raspberry. Um, it is darker than I would think a white tea should be, but that's just me. It's, eh, I don't know. I'm. Mm. Uh, it is clear. Uh, there's a little bit. There's a little bit of particulate, but it's it's not much. Uh, it is an overwhelming smell of raspberry. You cannot smell the tea at all. And that is like drinking a cup of hot raspberry. Guck. Yep. Um, <laughs> okay, so you can't taste the white tea in it at all. Um, it truly is like drinking a cup of hot raspberry. Um, I don't mind raspberry, but in a hot tea, I, it's not my favorite. This is a hot fruit tea, which I do not care for. Uh, I would prefer this to be iced. Uh, if I'm going to drink it. Um, it does have a nice strong consistency to it to where you could add it to something else like to a Ceylon tea and it could probably hold up in that and you know have a raspberry Ceylon uh, or you could probably cook with it or bake with it um, if you're needing a raspberry flavor that might not be so bad um, but just as a hot fruit tea it is not for me. Ooh sirree. Ooh. <laughs> uh, all right, so if you have had this tea before and you enjoy it, please comment below and tell me to get off my high horse and, you know, all that jazz. Uh, other than that, though, I'm going to say thank you for coming around and having a couple with me today. I appreciate your time. 
Um, thank you so much for taking a little bit of time out of your schedule and this busy holiday season um, to spend it with me. I appreciate that greatly. Uh, thank you so much. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.